Well, uh, we are open-minded and uh, active and uh, uh, look at the opportunities, you know. Do you think it may be more likely to be a loan signing that, that will happen? It can happen. We still uh, try to bring at least one body in, yes, uh, because we are a bit uh, hit now uh, by the, uh, uh, the red card of Flamini, uh, the setback of uh, Ramsey, uh, the fact that Wilcher is not available, that I hope will be short term. But uh, we are in an area where we had plenty of players, suddenly a bit short. They're all midfielders, which would suggest, is it a midfielder that you're specifically looking at? Uh, it's one of, a, of a, so one of the solutions we look at, yes. Do you feel you have to do business in the transfer window today to stay in touch with Manchester Look, you look in, in my job, you always have to. You have to win, you have to buy, you have to listen, and we all do, do that. How do you feel about having to do it on the last day of a transfer window, though? In a perfect world, this would all have been sorted out. In a perfect world, uh, uh, that, first of all, doesn't exist. And secondly, uh, all the transfer windows have always been like that, 80% uh, of uh, of the activities happened on the last day. It was always like that. Uh, if you want my signature, I would scrap the transfer window in winter with, with ease. 80 percent, I said. <laughs> Don't transform my statements already in 100 <laughs> percent. Leave me a little bit of room. <laughs> At the moment, we need more defenders, uh, midfielders. So, the, the sort of search for a striker. We are still open as well, you know. If you something comes up, uh, we are not against it. And has something changed with the Draxler situation? Because it seems as though that was moving forward earlier in the week. Look, uh, the Draxler situation has been created by the newspapers, not by uh, by me. And uh, you ask me where is that situation, I say uh, nothing is happening on that front. Is he a player that you think will move at all? Will he stay at Schalke? He will stay at Schalke. Um, and just finally, for me, if, if you don't manage to bring anyone in, if the 20% happens, mm -hmm. will you still be confident that you can achieve your targets? Yes. Because uh, why should we not? Uh, we have done it. Uh, we are in a position to do it. After 23 games, is the squad we have available now. So why should we suddenly give up? Can you just tell us a little more about the um, setback that Aaron Ramsey's had in, in training? I mean, is it right he could be out for, uh, for another month or so? Yes. Uh, it is certainly a few weeks. It will be between four and six weeks. I count six. Uh, so I haven't. No bad surprise, but of course it's a it's a blow for us because we lost recently Walcott for a long period. Now Ramsey is out for a long period, and uh, it's a big setback. You've been top for a long time until Manchester City overtook you midweek. Uh, are you expecting a response from the players as a result against Palace or something? Of course, a very strong one, and. Uh, uh, we are still very, very close, but of course we want to respond quickly after uh, having dropped two points at Southampton. I knew, we knew all that Southampton could be a, a tricky place to go, but uh, it was, and uh, Southampton played well, but uh, the regret we have is uh, that we were leading in the game and got caught back. Everybody seems to be pointing at Manchester City as the, the champions, Tim Sherwood at Spurs saying they're the best team on the planet, Jose Mourinho mm -hmm. at Chelsea saying, no, we, we're not going to be celebrating winning the league title this year, it's all about, all about Manchester City is the suggestion, but do you, do you feel that that's uh, not insulting, but, but passing over your chances a little? Maybe, but uh, you know, it's uh, always people uh, are always tempted to go to definite conclusions after one game. What is for sure, we have played 23 games, we are one point behind Man City uh, and uh, in the, uh, we, were, we are today in a better situation than uh, at the start of the season after four games. We look at the first, we are in the second part of the season after four games 
uh, we are one point behind Man City. We have 15 games to make a difference with them. I believe we have our chances and uh, what is even more important is that uh, we are fully committed and uh, to play our chances uh, with full belief, you know, and uh, I'm convinced uh, we can do it.